Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. As we all know, ASML has mastered the lifeline of advanced lithography machines, especially EUV lithography machines. As long as ASML refuses to supply, it is no exaggeration to say that without EUV lithography machines, there is no way to produce advanced chips of 5 nanometers and above. In the Sino-US chip dispute, ASML has played a very important role because its supply cut has greatly affected companies such as Huawei and SMIC. And its CEO also said that even if the drawings are made public, you can't make it. Like TSMC founder Morris Chang, ASML is not optimistic about the development of China's chip industry and has made bad remarks and badmouthed the development of China's chip industry. However, China's technology has developed to this day and it has seen all kinds of storms and sarcasm. The outside world's pessimism, suppression and insults will only become the source of power and constantly inspire the fighting spirit of Chinese technology companies. After several years of intensive cultivation and research, China's chip industry has made great progress. Under such a background, not only TSMC's Morris Chang has changed his words, but even the attitude of ASML's CEO has changed. Isn't this world too realistic? Recently, the U.S. media revealed that ASML's CEO admitted in an interview that China has made great progress and technological breakthroughs in self-developed lithography machines and complained that the U.S. suppression measures will only backfire. Christophe Fouquet said that those who are blocked will work harder to succeed. What does it mean? If the United States continues to put pressure on China and uses suppression to stop China's development, it will have the opposite effect and accelerate the breakthrough and development of China's technology industry. Another point is that ASML's CEO also advised the United States that instead of spending time and energy suppressing competitors such as China, it is better to focus on itself and innovate more. Obviously, more and more companies have recognized the reality that suppression does not work on China at all, and focusing on themselves is the top priority. Some people may be curious, why did ASML suddenly wake up? In fact, it was not sudden, but reality taught ASML a lesson. When the United States cut off the supply of EUV lithography machines to China, ASML was not affected too much. After all, in the Chinese market, only SMIC spent hundreds of millions to purchase an EUV lithography machine. At that time, EUV lithography machines were in short supply, and TSMC, Samsung, 
and Intel were able to cover its annual production capacity. ASML mainly supplied some obsolete DUV lithography machines to the Chinese market. So ASML was so arrogant and fearless at that time. However, as the senior U.S. technological competition became more and more fierce, the United States continued to modify the rules and continuously upgraded the technological blockade and suppression against China, which also made ASML very passive and its supply to China became very unfree. Under such a background, ASML's sales to China also shrank, which directly affected its annual revenue. So there was a new conclusion that the U.S. export ban would be counterproductive. In the final analysis, when it comes to their own interests, their attitudes change. This also proves from the side that it is the right choice for China to strengthen independent research and development, adhere to scientific and technological innovation, hold core technologies in its own hands and accelerate domestic substitution. No matter how the attitude of foreign companies changes, it has nothing to do with us. As ASML said, we should focus on our own innovation and research and development. With good products and technologies in hand, we will not be afraid of suppression and sanctions. ASML once said that China could not build lithography machines, but now it has changed its words to admit that China's technological breakthroughs and warned that U.S. suppression will only accelerate China's innovation. Reality has taught ASML a lesson when interests are damaged arrogance will eventually bow. China's chip industry has proved with strength that independent research and development is the strongest weapon against blockades. Nowadays, both domestic lithography machines and domestic chips have achieved some results, and the future is promising. Keep working hard.